Hello friends, welcome to Amazon Software Webcast and in today's video demonstration, we are going to see how to configure a group policy to display last logon information on the Windows welcome screen. Windows has a useful feature that allows to display the information about the last interactive sign-in attempt directly on Windows welcome screen. It looks like this, each time when a user types the password to log on into Windows system, the information about the date and time of the last successful or failed login attempts appears as well as the numbers of failed logons atoms will display also. If a wrong password is entered when trying to sign in to the Windows system, for example in case of an unauthorized access attempt, during the next system startup, the user will see a notification of a failed logon attempt. So in this video, I will show you how to display the information about the last interactive logon on the Windows welcome screen. This feature is available in all Windows operating system starting from Windows Vista. So for this demonstration, I have a one activity domain controller and we have a domain name Malgrip Local and we are going to use the our group policy management console to create a group policy. Now expand your forest, expand your domain and let's expand our domain name Malgrip Local. Let's create a one group policy, select create a GPU in this domain and link it here. Now let's specify the uh, policy name, let's uh, give a GPO1, just right click on the newly created GPO and uh, select edit. This will open group policy management editor console. On group policy management editor console, under computer configuration, expand policies, expand administrative templates, expand uh, windows component and select windows logon options here we have windows logon options on right hand side you can see there's options display information about previous logon during user logon double click on it this will open another console and on that console select enable these policy settings control whether or not the system display information about previous logon and logon failures to the user. Click on apply. Click on OK. Click on close to close the group policy management editor console. Now click on close. Let's close this and let's uh, right click on start button. Select run. Let's open command prompt and let's update the group policy by using command gp update slash force. Let's do the same on our client computer. Let's open command prompt and let's update the group policy by using GP updates less force. Okay, so once the group policy updates, let's log off from this Windows 10 computer and let's sign in again. Now here, as you can see, user one, now user one at mylab.local this is the first time you have interactively signed into this account. Click on OK. Now let's again log off from this Windows 10 computer. Let's uh, specify the wrong password and hit enter. Now as you can see the password is incorrect. Try again. Now let's again specify the correct password and hit enter. Now this time you can see a successful sign in message. The last time you interactively sign in on this computer was Thursday, April 21st, 2016, 10.54.05 a.m. Unsuccessful sign in is the last unsuccessful interactive sign in items on this account was Thursday, April 21st, 2016, 10.54.33 a.m. The number of unsuccessful interactive sign in items since your last interactive sign in is 1. So this is the way user can see the login information on the welcome screen directly. So this is the way how we can use group policy to display the login information on welcome screen. That's it for this video demonstration. Thanks for watching this video.